Amanda from Little Ones and today I'm going to be answering the question why is my toddler refusing to nap? So it does depend quite a lot on obviously the age of your toddler. So if we're talking about a three to four year old preschool or toddler then yeah they're refusing to nap because they aren't tired and they don't necessarily need a nap anymore. Maybe when they're sick or if they've had a late night then yeah sure that or a bad night they will need a little bit of a catch up nap in the middle of the day when they reach that dip in energy levels. But generally from the age of around two and a half to three years old, a toddler will be dropping their day nap. That will of course mean that their bedtime however needs to be um, around 6.30, 7 o'clock at night to ensure that they aren't getting overtired and they will get overtired often when they're just initially dropping their naps you'll need to do a, a nap every second day or once a week or you know it, does, it is quite a big transition of when they are dropping their nap. But if we are talking about a one or one and a half early two-year-old dropping their nap or refusing to nap, it's that you're going to need to keep that nap in for quite a bit longer. So around about one to one and a half is when they go from two naps down to one nap. Uh, and often right around here is when if parents have been still feeding to sleep or if their baby doesn't have any um, ability to fall asleep by themselves they will start resisting got having that uh, one nap a day but it's actually the optimal time to then bring in the ability to get them to start going to sleep by themselves because you can drop that morning nap out they'll be so tired by the middle of the day and they will have to go to sleep so it's a great time to get them to learn to go to sleep without their ability sorry without the need for for you needing to do something now between 15 months to two years old even or well, even probably around 18 months to two years old there is a little bit of a, a regression in uh, toddlers now this is where they really start playing on uh, playing up and they they know you know especially if they've got older siblings that they are having a nap and their older siblings are out in the in the lounge playing so they do start to play up for you and they will start resisting their naps but be consistent, keep doing what you're doing, stick to the knitting, keep putting them in bed, keep winding them down um, and making sure that they do still have a nap and that good time to re revive their energy to get them through the rest of the day because if they don't then you will have one very overtired toddler at the end of the day and as I said so you will need to keep that nap in right until between earliest would be two and a half years old to drop it to three years old. I hope that answered your question. Remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more question and answers like this and more free sleep advice. You can go to our website littleones.co.